All right, so there's been a big announcement, essentially. Uh, we're going over that. There's been the big announcement of the Honkai Pack 3rd Honkai Star Rail collab. We have a behind the scene previews. I assume we're going to get a proper trailer because this is like just a 43 seconds preview. So we are probably going to be getting um, a, a, a very soon announcement, proper trailer that will show us what we can expect. Uh, but for now, we do have this video. I think we have... Yeah, we do have the we do have the, the the subtitles here on Twitter. They they there's no subtitles, so here we are. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Who is going to be the best uh, galactic baseballer? A popcorn explosion? <laughs> Never let you go! Bra -ba 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 -ba. Uh, you can finally go home, Weld. True. Alright, so uh, my opinion is... <coughs> For context, Honkai Pack 3rd is a MiHoYo game as well. It's um, it's not the first game for MiHoYo, nor the first game in the HoYoverse kind of cinematic... Well, not cinematic, but like game... Well, it's HoYoverse. It's not the first game in the HoYoverse. There have been a few games before. Um, it's not necessarily the third game. It, that's not why it's called Honkai Pack 3rd. Um, but there was like some other games like Fly Me to the Moon. Was it Call Me Fly Me to the Moon? Fly to the Moon? That was also, I think, like GGZ, like Gun Girls something. Um, anyway, I, I so essentially what other information we have uh, is that this is going to be happening in 7.9 in... Honkai Pack 3rd. Currently, we are in 7.7 .7 in Honkai. I, I do play the game. Um, and Chinese servers is a little bit in advance. So it's um, it's 7.8 in Chinese servers, essentially, right? Uh, they're like a month uh, ahead, something I liked around there. So it's not that much, but a little bit. Oh, that's Lily. You're so upset about the the collab. Why are you upset, Lee? Lee is very upset. So um. So for those who don't know, there was a collab in the past with Genshin and Honkai, right? Because again, it's two whole universe games. And during said collab, we did get access in Honkai Backstreet to like Kishin that didn't end up being playable, but Fischl did. And is still playable and obtainable in Honkai Pack Search. It's actually you can farm for her for free, for free. And that's uh, that's all good and dandy. That said, in Genshin we have nothing of the sort. There was not the collab was only one sided. So what I'm worried about uh, right now when it comes to this collab is that it could end up being similar to Genshin, I really hope it's not going to be the case. But the reason why I'm a little bit worried is that 7.9 for CN servers in Honkai Pack 3rd is going to be in about a month and a half, maybe, something like that. And it's going to be, well, it's going to be in one patch, and for global servers, it's going to be in two patch. And if we consider where we are right now in HSR, we just got, I want to say, did we get 2.4? I think we got 2.4, or is it 2.5? I don't even know. But what patch is it currently? HSR 2.5? We are in 2.5, yeah. And so if you kind of put in perspective, uh, we just got 2.5, we already know, we already had the drip marketing for 2.6, which is next month. And in terms of just timing, it sounds pretty bad because if the the collab is supposed to be at the same time as CN servers, because that's when it's going to come out in 
Hong Kai back third. That's going to be next patch, right? Um, and 2.6, I mean, we only got Rappa announced unless they just wanted to, you know, shadow drop something, like surprise us. Maybe it's just like, oh, we're getting Rappa, and then phase two, we're actually getting the collab, right? Um, the hope is that we are going back to Pinaconi because Rappa is on Pinaconi, I believe. Which means that maybe, you know, Pinaconi, we, we can see, you know, we had Welt, we saw um, Firefly in Pinaconi over here. Uh, right there, that's Pinaconi, right? Um, now, that I think, at least. Now, here, this also looks like Pinaconi, I think, but this is a lot of the current character. This is a lot of the Luofu, right? Which is like, I, I don't know. I, I'm not sure where this is supposed to take place. So, are we actually going to be getting the collab in HSR? I don't know. I think it's not looking super, super good. It could be Arc City. Yeah, it could be, I guess. But here, like... This place does not look like ours. This place just looks like the Luofu. It looks like his office or whatever it's called. So um, I think if it's not coming next patch for HSR, maybe we're going to get more time. Maybe they're going to time the release in HSR with the same time as the release on global Honkai Apex 3rd, which would be two patch. And in that case, it's going to be 2.7, which, I mean... How many patches are we getting in HSR? Are we... I think we're going up to 2.7 and then it goes to 3.0. Right? So that's not a lot of time left. And um, we already had a bunch of potential new character for 2.7. Um, I mean, we, we know that we might be getting a Tingyun or a Tingyun SP. Uh, more characters like that. We still don't have, you know, Skrullum and those kind of characters. And I'm just sitting here and wondering, like, are we actually going to be getting collab characters? Um, we might be, maybe we're going to be getting, like, a new story. But I, like, it, it feels less likely to actually happen. Um, and this would be, this would really suck. The Fate collab is going to be in a year. There's plenty of time. Fate collab is in a year. So what worries me is that, is this going to go the same as Genshin, which is kind of lame. Um, that sounds just like more of a way to maybe get HSR players into playing Honkai Back 3rd, which, I mean, I understand. Honkai Back 3rd is like, kind of like their, their little passion project, right? Um, so I really hope it's not a one-sided collab. I hope it's, it's, we actually get something in HSR. Um, but even if we do, like, it doesn't seem likely we're going to be getting any characters, right? Um, unless, as I said, maybe it's going to be phase two, just after wrap up. That would be crazy, by the way. That would be, like, bamboozling level of insane. So, um, yeah, I don't know. Um, but, like, the potential is freaking massive, right? Uh, like, uh, Senti on the Luofu, uh, Welt... Like, I mean, the whole conversation with, like, Welt, does he want to go back, right? Uh, I mean, he non came back third. He has his son, uh, his adopted son, right? He has his definitely not wife. There's, like, there's, there's so much stuff going on, and there's, there's potential for very interesting storyline, in my opinion, right? And, like, just the idea that we got a two galactic baseballer, like, uh, fighting each other uh, could be awesome, too. I'm always very excited to see more Elysia. She's one of my favorite characters. So, uh, yeah, I, I mean, I'm super, super hype, but I'm worried nonetheless. Um, I'm trying not to doom post here. I just temper your expectations, wait for more announcements, wait for a proper announcement, a proper trailer. Um, and, uh, yeah, we'll see, we'll see, because in the past, in Genshin, that ended up being pretty eh, in my opinion, for Genshin players, so, um, yeah, let's, uh, let's hope, let's take a puff of the hopium, and, um, I'll get back to you when we get more news, cheers!